Hey people, it's me again. And um, today in this video, I'm going to be showing you my Hit Entertainment VHS collection. So, um, there is a lot of give or take in this um, collection for some reason. But um, I do have a lot more um, other tapes to um, show as well for um, Hit Entertainment. So, you know, you'll expect quite, I guess a good collection but I don't know how to describe it. I know a lot of you have more tapes than me but still but these are the tapes I have. So yeah I'm gonna start with the newest first and I'll go to the oldest last. So um yeah so it's gonna be quite different. The first VHS I have is um Barney's Big Surprise the live stage show. It's the front, the side and the back. It's got two acts in the tape and um this is on box at least 77 minutes, and um, yeah, that's the tape. Um, print day is the um, the 31st of Feb 31st of March 2003. Is it? I think it is. Yeah, I think it is. Is what it says. Focus. No, I forget. But you'll probably know what it is anyway. But I think it is 31st of March. If there is a 31st, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, next is a double VHS of um, Christmas children's favourites. It's the front, the sides, and the back. So, on tape 1 we have Oswald, Rubber Dubbers, Percy Parkkeeper and Barney. On tape 2 there's Angie, Barina, Bob the Builder, Pingu, Kipper and Brambley Hedge. And this is um, 127 minutes altogether, I think. So yeah, here are the two tapes. There's tape 1 and here's tape 2. I used to have um, Brightest Children's Ferrets tape 2, no, 2 tape. Yeah. Two tape set, but I sadly don't anymore. But I'll get it soon, hopefully. Once I have the money, but still. Anyway, next one I have. Sadly, this one doesn't have a cover, but um, it's Barney. Let's go to the zoo. So yeah. And um, is there a print? No, there's no print there. This one. Yeah, there's no print day, as you can see. Yeah, the same goes for Christmas children's favourites, which I forgot to mention. The next VHS I have is um, Anthony Barina, The Show Must Go On. I also have this on um, DVD as well, but I have a VHS as well. The front, the sides, and the back. And, um... As you can see at the bottom here, it's a bit cracked at the bottom, but um, when you open the tape, you're going to see something a bit worse, which um, I'll go through in a minute. So yeah, this is um 71 minutes. This comes in a pink case, which is quite nice. And there's the tape. Yes, look what happened here. There's a giant crack on the tape. I've used, I, I, also, I also showed this on the live stream, that, um, that this, you know, this, this crack, you know, damaged the tape, but, oh well. Anyway, print date is the 22nd of September 2002. Yeah. Next one I have is Kipper the Robot and Other Stories. Here's the front, the side, and the back. And um, this is um, 43 minutes. The tape right here. The print day is the um, the tenth of March two thousand four. So this is a late print. This I mean, I forgot to mention this tape also has um black wheels in it as well, which is quite cool. Yeah, only reason why it says it's a late print is because um you know on the back of the tape it um it says two thousand one for some reason. And yeah, this is the only cool VHS that I have that has the um. Hit entertainment, hit entertainment PLC logo. This is apparently. I don't know why. So yeah, 
Can you do my other cubic virtue text I have have hit the girl on it? The next virtue I have, which is also got the hint and PLC logo on it, and it's um Barney Outdoor Adventure. Sorry, focusing. Focus. There we go. It's the front. Side. Sorry about the scamps there, but here's the back. There's a whole bunch of Barney songs in there. And this is um fifty five minutes. Yeah, this casing is not in the very best condition, but the tape still plays fine though, so I'll, I'll appreciate that. This comes in this purple case. And here's the tape right here. The print date is the um, um, 6th of May 2004. I don't think this is really stored, but um, you know, I'm trying my best. The next VHS I have is um, Brambley Hedge Winter Story. There's the front, the sides, the back. This also has the um, Entertainment PLC logo in it as well for some reason. So, yeah. This is the only Brambley Hedge VHS I have. I'm planning to get the other ones, which are um, Summer Story, Spring Story, and. Um, Autumn story, then that'll be my Brammy Hedge VH collection completed. I also have Winter Story on um, Christmas Tools Ferris as well. And here's the tape right here. Print date is um the second of January two thousand and one. And here's an advert inside for um summer story, autumn story and winter story. And then we've got Percy Park Keeper, uh, One Snowy Night and the Rescue Party. The Secret Path wasn't around back when any of these came out. Maybe. Although there was an advert for the Secret Path at the start of this tape, but it's not on the other side of um, Winter Story for some reason. I don't know why, but that's weird. The next VHS I have is a Children's Ferrets VHS, and it's um, Children's Ferrets 3. Yeah, these are like, you know, the early, you know, Children's Ferrets VHSs to um, be released. So yeah, it's the front, the side. And the back. It's got um, Bob the Builder, Kipper, the Magic Key, Ultra Bob the Koala, I think that's correct. Right? Percy Park Keeper, Lamp Pierce, Sheep, and Animal Stories. So, yeah. And um, here's the tape. And as you can see, the label looks very odd looking for some reason. It's like a reader, Reader's Digest. I think that's what it has on it for some reason. Yeah, that's quite, I think that's quite odd or rare, I don't know. But, um, I think there's a print date. No, I don't think there's a print date. Oh, wait. No, no, no print date. Next one I have is, um, Kipper, Hide and Seek, and Other Stories. It's the front, the sides, and the back. Um, episode, no, uh, these are the episodes, <laughs> you can see them on the back here, but, um, and this is, um, this is, um, 43 minutes, even though it says that it's a 1999 VHS, but, but I believe this is actually a 2000 VHS, but, um, I think we're getting a little bit mixed up here with this tape for some reason, so yeah, here is the tape. And um, print date is um, 27th of February 2001. So I think this is a late print. The next VHS I have is um, Bob the Builder, Scarecrow Dizzy, and other stories. It's the front, the sides, the back. Episode, no, these are the episodes. <laughs> They're on the back. And, um, this is 15 minutes. And there's something very weird about this tape. In the opening to this VHS, there is no Hit Entertainment or Hit Video logo at the start of this tape. But in the closing, there is the Hit Video logo. But on the on the um, side and the back, it shows Hit Home Entertainment. I don't get it. Like, they're getting a little bit mixed up here for some reason. So yeah, it's very strange. Here's the tape. Print date is the 5th of November 2000.
off those two. Other tapes. Um, I have this one, I do, but I don't have the other three. The next one I have is um, a rare VHS of um, Kippo the Big Breeze novel stories. Um, this is a Marks and Spencer's copy of um, Kippo the Big Breeze novel stories, as you can see here. So I'm very lucky to have this, and um, the opening is very strange as well, because you know, at the start of this tape, it shows the um, television entertainment logo at the start for some reason. And then it's followed by the actual episodes, and it says Marks and Spencer's coffee on the intro. And then, at the end of the tape, it just shows a blank screen. So, yeah, very weird indeed. It's the front, the side, and the back. And, um, yeah. And I don't know what this thing is right here, but, um... I hardly see that on tapes. Wait, come on, focus. There we go. Well, I've never seen that before. <laughs> like, it's very odd. Here's the tape right here. Print date is the 8th of November 2000. So, yeah, as you can see, it's a late print because it's Marks and Spencer's. Actually, no, maybe this did release in 2000. Because I can't tell, because it says 1999 on the back of the tape. But I can't tell. The next VHS I have is Kippo looking after Arnold and other stories. It's the front, the side, and the back. This is fifth, no, 45 minutes. Ryan. Here's the tape. And, yeah, as you can see, it's hit video on the label book. And, but on the side and the back, it shows the entertainment. On the actual tape, it actually shows hit video. So this is getting, pr this is pretty weird. So, so I guess, you know, they probably used like a, I don't know what they were doing, but still. Print date is the, um, the 2nd of March, 2000. Anyway, next VHS I have is one of my favourites. Kippo Christmas Eve and other stories. It's the front, the side, the back. And the only reason why it's my favourite um, Kippo VHS because it's got a lot of really good episodes on it. Um, especially the one named um, The Magic Lamp. That is like my favourite kit episode of all time. So yeah. Um, this is a 1979 VHS. Here's the tape. Print date is the... Um, is uh, November 26th, 1999. So I get, they've got kind of mixed up a bit here. Because they put November before 26th. Like... Why would there be a month that's... Why would there be like 26 months? <laughs> like, that's weird. They got kind of mixed up there. And here's an advert inside for um, other tapes and books. Next VHS I have is... Um, um, Kipper Treasure Hunt and other stories. Is the front. The sides. Sorry about the hole up there. And here's the back. And you have a scene with him laying on the um, on the table, which isn't really on this tape. It's actually from a book. Well, I can't remember which one it was, but I don't think that scene's on this tape for some reason. Neither is that scene where the duck looks all dirty, but <laughs> yeah. And this is 45 minutes again. Here's the tape, hit video release, and... Print date is the um, the 12th of August 1999, so this is a late print, or a reprint, whatever you call them. Next one I have is um, Kipper Circus, another stories, and here I've seen that's also not in this tape. Well, I forgot to mention, um, you know this scene with him, you know, holding the um, fish? That's from the goldfish, that, that picture is, which isn't on this tape. So yeah, but it's the front, the side, the back, and here's a scene from the camping trip, which is also not on this tape. Is that the camping trip? Yeah, I think it is. This is a 1998 VHS. And here we have the Hit Entertainment reprint, but on the actual tape, shows the video. 
Print date is the 15th of August 2000, so yeah, another late print. I think it is. Sorry if I'm wrong, Jack Cal, but I don't know much about print dates. <laughs> but hopefully that is the correct print date. The next one I have is Bob the Builder Scoop Safe Today, Never Stories. It's the front, side, and the back. And now this is like 46 minutes. So it's like one minute longer than the other drip tapes I've showed. Here's the tape, and here's an advert for um, um, a lot of the with the VHS. And this came from Asda as well, as you can see, and this is like a sticker for it. Okay. Okay, the next VHS I have is Kiffa Snowy Day and Other Stories. This was my first ever Kiffa VHS I ever got. And um, I really liked it, I still like it today. It's the front, the sides, and the back. And I believe this scene is also from a book, which I don't know if that's on this tape. But you know, never mind. Here's the tape right here. I think there's a print. Oh, there's no print there on this one. And. Yeah, the inside is just the same as um, Christmas Eve. The next VHS I have, sadly this one does not have a cover, but um, it's the little ghost and other stories. And um, yeah. print date is the um, the 10th of April 1998. So another late print there. I have a lot of reprints for some reason. The late prints, like, like I don't. I seem to have like the later copies rather than the original copies for some reason. Anyway, here's my last VHS that I have, and it's Kip of the Biz Turns of the Stories. It's the front, the sides, and the back. And um, not I can't remember what scene this is from. I think it's from a book as well. That's from the um. The original Kipper book um, cover that I um that you know that was like the front cover for it. Now they've used it on this tape as well for some reason. And now this version is quite different to the US version because in this view in this version there is the episode the paddling pool, but it's not on the US version. It was um split up to um um the pig's present VHS, the US version of pig's present. So um yeah, it's kind of a bit different there. This is 43 minutes. I don't know what running time a little ghost was, but um, it's a tape and so got the cross there. I got this from my children's hospital. And here we have the Hit Entertainment reprint again. And here we have another reprint, which is the 14th of April 2000. And so, yeah, that includes this Hit Entertainment VHS collection. So yeah, here I'll um, I'll sort these out, and then I can you know let you lot see them again. So yeah, here they are. These are all the tapes I have. So expect loads more tapes on the way. I will get more. Don't worry, I will get loads more of these tapes. I'll probably try and focus on getting some shows that you know. I haven't got yet from here in like, I don't have any Percy the Park Keeper, or Rubber Dubbers, or, um, you know, I don't have any Wiggles VHSs either, like, I need to build up my collection a bit more now, so, um, so, expect that on the way, but I have got a box set coming in the mail soon, it's like a children's ferrets DVD box set that I've got coming in the mail soon, so, um, there will be a DVD update on the way for that, and I will see you guys soon, bye bye, peace out, and... Also, play subscribe.